Okay, this is part two to the video because in the first one he was kind of fussy. So I'm just going to basically talk to you about like from the whole birth experience up to now. <clears throat> so it's been a month since I had my little baby. And so basically it was funny because like a cup like a couple months before I had him, like the doctor said something about how I might not be able to have a home birth or something. So like for a whole like month or two I was freaking out and crying I'm like I I really want a home birth so like at like the last minute she was like okay you can have your home birth and then I was excited again because I was really depressed for a while because I want to stay with my babies and I said I can't go to a hospital because then I would be away from my babies for like two days and I couldn't do that so, yeah, like at the last minute, she said, you can have your home birth. So then we started planning, and I was supposed to have a water birth again. But the midwife ended up leaving to go get the materials for the water birth. And, like, basically, I started getting, like, really heavy contractions. And I'm like, if she don't make it, um, back to the house fast enough then I'm gonna have this baby on my own <laughs> and I was freaking out because my husband was even home yet and like it was just everything was just happening so fast because like the whole day I was kind of like denying the fact that I was gonna have a baby because I'm um, like just the contractions wasn't that heavy or anything for like hours and then just randomly, they just got super heavy really fast. So I'm just sitting there laughing to myself because um, a couple months back, I was like, what if I have this baby on my own? <laughs> because if they keep saying that I can't have my home birth, I'm going to just end up having the baby at home and just going to the doctors or something. But... What a coincidence that I actually did end up giving birth on my own because the doctors didn't make it back on time. So I remember calling the midwife and I said, I'm having the baby now. So my husband walks in and he he goes in the room with the babies. And I'm I'm like, someone please go get my husband. I was telling my grandma, can you just go get my husband because the baby is coming. I need someone to hold my leg up. <laughs> so he as soon as he came out, I said, come put my leg up. And then um, my brother was standing there, and I was like, you put my other leg up. <laughs> and like I just went right into it. I just start pushing, and then he came out. And it was just a beautiful experience because I did it, like, basically all by myself because it wasn't any nurses, any doctors, or midwives, or anything. I just guided my husband and my brother and told them to hold, hold my legs up, and I pushed. And my sister-in-law got it on camera. If you guys didn't see it, it's like the second last video that I just put up. But, wow, yeah, it was a crazy night. Like I said, I did. I was denying the fact I was going to have the baby Um, that day. I'm thinking I still got, like, a few more days to a week. But, yep, my due date was on the 18th, but I ended up giving birth on the 12th. So, yeah, he was six days early. Aw of my babies was early Kevin was 10 days early and Titus was 3 days early and Mr. Silas Sora Bolton was 6 days early and he got really big really fast um he came out um he came out 7.8 pounds and then like I took him to the doctors 2 weeks later and he was um 9.8 he gained exactly two pounds in um, a week or two. One second. 
So as you can see, he got really big really fast. I love him so much. <laughs> Time went by really fast. This is my third baby boy, and I'm really happy to have him. I wouldn't trade them for anything. They make me so happy. So that's about it. That was my story about what happened the birth on his birth date. <laughs> it was just a shock. It just happened. Everything happened so fast. The whole day was just slow. I'm like not thinking anything. And then just at the last second, I just start getting contractions like crazy. But okay, he's here now and he's a month old. And just um, comment any videos you want me to make. Um, I'm, it's, yeah, it's been crazy. I haven't re really made any videos because, yeah, I have a lot going on, obviously. But if you comment and ask me to make any type of videos, I will try my best to keep you guys posted. Okay, love you guys. Good night. Bye.